Hi, my name is Dr. Jody Samra. In my experience as a registered psychologist, anxiety and depression are very common challenges. For some people, these can be lifelong difficulties. For others, they are a response to stressors in one's life. And it could be as just as simple as, as you know, making a decision on something, but the problem to me seemed like it was so much more. It felt like something was coming in sideways that was throwing me off um, my, my confidence. Even though I had all kinds of people that would love to listen to me and be around me, when you're in that state, you don't perceive the world to be there for you. It's common to feel low, stressed out, worried, depressed, irritable, or angry, or even to just feel nothing. The life skills approach used in Bounce Back has benefited many people struggling with low mood, depression, and anxiety. You'll learn how to solve problems, build your confidence, and start thinking helpful thoughts. You'll find out how to improve your sleep and learn some easy ways to get yourself healthy. And you'll learn how to be more assertive, letting other people know what you want in a respectful way. Providing the Bounce Back DVD to patients is a way of providing some advice in it an intimidating way. Uh, the DVD is a simple reminder of how to live life to the fullest, um, where one can actually learn about how we deal with emotions and we deal with our mood affecting our emotions. There are a lot of people who deal with mental illness and a lot of people who deal with mental illness successfully. Sheila, you've had an opportunity now to view the video. How helpful do you think these life skills are for people that are dealing with mood issues? I think they're incredibly helpful. Um, I think, you know, sleep and exercise, that's a given. Um, certainly diet, making sure you put good things into you, not sort of packing on and getting the great big sugar high. That's not going to be good if you're already suffering from anxiety. It's going to create more holes inside you. I know this from experience. Some of the strengths of the Bounce Back program are the toolkit they give you in order uh, to approach the issues. A lot of them are quite logical, so it's not anything complicated to remember. I could probably go on for hours about the strengths of the program, but um, for myself it was um, having those tools um, simplified and laid out for me to feel comfortable enough to break down all those negative thoughts. The most important thing to remember is that you have the power to change your situation and to feel better. With the right tools and with practice, you can bounce back.